This is the Metalon ICI ink. You can see it's on printed on plastic right here. We actually printed this with an inkjet printer. It's flexible, it's bendable. Uh, it's about 500 nanometers thick, and you'll notice that it has the dark color that's not associated with copper. That's because it's not copper yet. It's copper oxide. It has no conductivity at all. We're measuring it. It's about 100 squares. So we're putting it on the test fixture. Uh, the pulse forge tool is going to provide the activation energy to trigger the reaction. Uh, the ink is formulated with a reduction agent. This is the whole the whole trick to the product. Uh, the energy from the tool drives the uh, the reaction. It strips the oxygen away from the copper oxide. And here at the end of the processing step, which is in real time, we just saw this in real time, the copper oxide has become copper. And we see this in the color change. We're going to measure it with our voltmeter. And we went from no conductivity to 10 or 11 ohms. And because this is 100 squares of, uh, uh, of sample size, this is about 110 milliohms per square, which is two or three or four times the uh, uh, bulk resistivity of copper depending on how thick the material is.